guys, welcome back to another random games video where I peruse the internet and hopes to try to find something that'll give us laughs, spooks, or just any emotion. You know what I'm saying? So, we got a few games to try out today. Some of them are scary, maybe not all of them will be scary. We'll see how it goes. But if that sounds good to you, then without further ado, you're as ready as I am. What are we waiting for? Let's do this. So here we are back again and let me let me ask you guys something Did you ever just get uh, super upset because you walk out your car you just you just got done with work or you just got done you know grocery shopping dealing with kids whatever it may be and you're just ready to get the fuck out of there so you walk out of your car right you see like an orange something glowing on your windshield and you're like ah somebody's handing out flyers maybe for some free shit I don't know let's let's go check it out so you walk up to the car and you're wondering Man, I really hope, I really hope this is nothing bad. You're wondering, like, what could it be? You know what I mean? So you walk up, grab that shit off your windshield wiper, unfold it, pull it on out, and it's a parking violation. What the hell did I do wrong? I always park here. Or I thought I was able to park here. What is my pass for if it's not going to work? Why did I get a ticket? And then you just get real pissed when you're driving home. Like, the whole drive home, you're just silent because you're pissed off. Well, not in this game, motherfuckers. Not in this game. In this game, you get to take it out. Take that aggression out for those faulty-ass parking tickets, my friends. Like, the ones that you don't deserve, this is for you guys. All those parking tickets you got that, that were just unjust should not have been... That ticket should not have even been written. That tree was wasted for that shit. Well, this one's for you. And me. I've gotten lots of parking tickets that uh, definitely put me in a spot, too. So without further ado, because that's what we've been uh, doing, we're going to jump right into parking ticket mayhem. And see if we can, I don't know, maybe work out some of these parking tickets. You dig? Let's do it. What the fuck? God damn it! Exactly. Fuck! All I did was go grab some takeout. Why the fuck are you giving me a fucking parking ticket? Right, dude. God damn it! Right, fuck! Dude. Right. Fuck this. I'm not taking this anymore. What the fuck is going on? Exactly. And just like that, we're in it. I ain't taking, I ain't taking no L's today. I already took an L. There is no more L's today. You want to give me a parking ticket? You can't park there. You can't park there. You can't park there. Somebody give me a fucking monster truck. These are lined up beautifully. Whoa. All right. All right. I do have a gun. Fuck this. We're doing this shit. We're spraying these motherfuckers. Look at this shit. Excuse me, sir. You can't park in the sky. You can't park up there. Keep it in the air. Keep it in the air. Ah, oh, you can't. Or you probably could. Ooh, got him, got him, got him, got him. Getting mowed. Lawnmower. Lawnmower for cars. See you guys. See you later. Hey, have a nice day, man. See ya. Have a beautiful time. See ya. Have a beautiful time. Oh, yeah. Right through the fence that really doesn't exist. It's only there sometimes. You know what I mean? That that fence has a lot of days off. You dig? A lot of days off. Oh, yeah. Get it, 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 get it. Got him. And the buildings are destructible. So, you know, I'm having fun with that, too. Just try to shoot my own car nothing happens. I mean, that's a good thing, because it would be destroyed. All right, we're getting all these fucking buildings. I'm done with it. I'm done with it. Oh, oh they let on fire. These are these are fire bullets, I guess. If you shoot uh, a building in real life, it spontaneously combusts. Did you know that? No, no I'm not Alan. Because I, I, I learned something today. I learned something today, and I'm, I'm proud of myself for that, for learning. Because normally I don't learn. You know what I'm saying? Normally I don't learn. Never learned my lesson, nothing like that. Get over here, bro. Clearly, I mean, look what I'm doing, right? I'm running around a parking lot with a fucking gat. Just taking out every police car that I see. Oh, keep him up, keep him up. Oh, that one's dead. Can't keep it up. Right to the ground. You love it. Long shot. Get him going. Oh, oh, you know the guy in there's throwing up. He's throwing up. If there is anybody in this. I don't know. That's fine. He's done. Give him the old zigzag. Don't do it to him, Tim. Don't do it to him. Oh, I gotta do it to him. You know I gotta do it to him. Come on, you can't tell me not to do it to him. You would do it to him, so I'm gonna do it to him. Shit. Oh, yeah, we're just gonna walk real slow and just pepper, pepper, salt, pepper. We got him. We got him. You ain't gonna survive this. Got him. And that's how you take care of a parking ticket. You know what I mean, guys? Like, that's not, that's the first time I handled a parking ticket that way. Normally I go to the office and hand money and be like, hey, here you go. But that was way more effective, I think. 
pretty good. With the city now leveled and returned to nature, Matthew escaped to a Canadian commune to smoke weed and never be heard from again. I like a good relatable story, you know? The tar the parking the tarking? The parking ticket was left forever unpaid. Tarking, 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 tarking. Good, don't pay that. I mean, if you're gonna pay the parking ticket, they'd probably make you pay for all those uh, property damages. Yeah. The end. Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Why not? Yes, indeed, indeed. Well, let's fire up another game. Alright guys, welcome back to our second game. It's called Father the Truth. Not really sure what it's about, but there's blood all over the place, and we're sitting at the opposite end of the table of them. Probably not good stuff to be said, but we're gonna hear him out. We're gonna hear him out right now. Let's do it. Oh, give me a break. See what he has to say, you know? Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. I was like, why can't I move? I was pressing E. How's your day been? You know what I mean? My day's, you know, that's, that's how my day's been. Shit. Give me the key. What's this say? Hey, kid. Me and mom are going out tonight. There's food in the kitchen and the TV is fixed. Stay safe. Don't snoop around. Dad. Why's it gotta be backspace, though? Alright. Oh, the sensitivity is very, very high. This sensitivity smoked some ganj, you know what I'm saying? Because it's fucking high. <laughs> Blazed. Alright, door's been unlocked. So we're going in it. What the hell? Oh, now I see what the hell, yeah. Uh, Dad, I know you're killing people. I'm just gonna do some laundry. I haven't had underwear for like three weeks. And I still won't because these are empty. Oh, are these banana crates? Thought it was laundry. Uh, no matter how you look at it, it's all trash. The sensitivity is large and in charge. Mom and Dad's bedroom. Don't need to go in there. Yeah, but let's do it anyway because, I mean, look at this. Maybe he has a gun under his bed he can use. Okay, he's not at the table. Thought he would be. TV's fixed. But we can't use it. Two men were reported missing today, both of whom are active duty police officers who are investigating the recent serial murders. Witness report states that a man in his 30s dressed in a suit covered in blood was found loading what looked like body bags in the trunk of his car. Eaglewood State Police Department urges the citizens to remain at ease as the police are actively patrolling the affected areas. Oh, I'm, I'm easy. Easy like Sunday morning. Easy like that guy's in this house and he's gonna kill me. Oh, yeah. The shit show. Might as well get some food. Can't even get food. Talking about food. Everything looks dingy, bro. And you just have your fire extinguisher just chilling in the corner. Fucking huge. Probably can't even lift that fucking thing, bro. Let alone use it to spray a fire. There's the laundry. That's what I was looking for. Let me throw some tidies in there, bro. Some tidy whites. What, what am I going to find in here? Like, I don't want to open these. Oh, okay. That's it? Alright. Shit. A matching uh, broom and or mop and bucket, whatever. Broom looks like a broom, but there's a bucket there. Um, Who the hell's that? Somebody left like giant hot dogs in here, bro. Ketchuped up and shit. Oh, I thought I saw a face. See, look, if you look like right there, doesn't that kind of look like a face? Is it? It's not. They had to do that on purpose, bro. All right, well we're gonna take a shit. Nah. I'm too nervous to take a poop right now. I don't know why, but I'll take that. A key? Maybe I can use this? Well, I mean, if you know what keys are used for, it's for opening doors, so 
you can definitely use it for that because that's what they do <laughs> a woman it sounded like it came from the garage so is that where we're gonna go what are we gonna do stab him in the eye with this key unlock his brain what the fuck's gonna happen dog explain it i need details where was the garage i haven't even been in there yet is it over here right next to my room now this is my room this isn't the garage, is it? Door's locked. Maybe there's another way to the garage. I mean, it's your house. Why are you looking at me? Um. Wow, bro. You'd swear I played this shit already or something, but I swear I didn't. I swear I didn't. I just go up to stuff and it lets me click them. Like, it's easy to find. I feel like if you guys played this, you would just find it. You just, you have your arrow on things, and whenever you put your arrow on something that you can use, it changes into a hand. So all you gotta do is move the arrow around and it changes into a hand, you know you gotta do it. So it's really easy to figure out. But it's cool how we're doing this, though. I mean, this is my own house, and I didn't know all this shit existed. That's nuts to me, bruh. Come on. Do not enter? I mean, I won't. Mom, oh god, why? Oh, no. What's up with this shit, bro? I heard something click from the basement. The, how close is the basement? You heard a tiny-ass click? Headlight's still on? Shit. So do... It's, it's the basement. This is where I was trying to go, right? Do I want to? Yeah, I have the key. <clears throat> All right, I'm kind of low-key nervous. I don't want to go in here. Ah, I love the Resident Evil style, guys. I see you. What is this place? What the fuck? What is going on? Now I can't open these? Oh, I can open this one? Oh, can we hide in this? Is there a reason I'm doing this, or is this in case he's chasing me? I hate it. I guess it's if he's chasing me. But I can only do it to that one? Only the middle? They do have a hiding mechanic. Can I use anything here? Like, I'm not even going to take the axe? Oh my god, bro. He, he's, where is he going to be? Behind us? Oh, fuck. Well, we know where we're going. Why is he knocking? Like, he doesn't know we're here, right? Why is he knocking? Like, we're gonna open the door and be like, Hey, man, what do you want? I thought it was the pizza guy. What the fuck is he doing? Why do you have bodies for decoration? Like, what are we doing? This is my dad? Not, not this guy. Oh, God. We're not gonna take that axe, though. When we, when, even though we just saw him, we're not gonna take the axe. We're, uh, we're a dummy, huh? Big fat fucking dummy, huh? Alright, anyway. I mean, yeah. We are. Oh, my. Oh, oh, my. Oh my god. What up, dude? I swear I, I'd expected him to, like, say something or move. Oh god, what is this? It's a note. Oh, you mean this? Bloody skeletons, dude. Not really sure about it. What the hell? What the hell? Like, how long have they been, have they been there? I don't know. That's crazy. You didn't smell anything? Because they rotted all the way out. Hi, how are you? Um, I, I'm just, just passing through. Dad. Oh, God. That guy, that's your dad? I 
Oh, you mean the dead guy. That was it. Not too bad. I, I, I'm a little confused, though, because I thought... So, is the guy... Is the demon your dad, then? Because, like, this was about... This was supposed to be about, like, the dad coming clean about something. That's This is not what I expected. Weird. Alright, guys, we're going to try to find one more game. We'll be right back. So here we are with our third and final game of the evening, my friends. It's called Computer Man. Know nothing about it. We're just going to go right in. Finally got home from my long shift today. Let's get on my laptop to see the news. Can we fix that light, homie? What are you dealing with here? What are you, what are you going through? Should I read all this? Downloading don'topen.exe. I don't know. Seemed like a good idea. Are you serious? This game is going to take some time. Blah, blah, blah. I missed what he said. Can we get this borderless? Uh, fuck. I just crashed the game. Alright. Sorry about that. But at least now we don't have the border at the bottom so we can read all the stuff. Let's try this again. Finally got home from a long shift. Let's check our emails. No emails. Okay. Internet browser. Let's just download the game. This download is going to take some time. Let's put this laptop in sleep mode while I grab a drink. Alright, will do, buddy. Let's go grab a drink out of this tiny fridge here. Oh, that's F, that's right. Not in the freezer. Frick, I have no soda left. Let's go outside and get some. Well, that's the freezer. Is that where you keep your soda? Shit's gonna explode, dog. Alright, fine. Let's go get some. I'm down. I'm down for whatever. Sure, it'll be a cool night. Can we do anything here? Better remember it's F to interact, not E. Keep pressing E first, you know? And it's like, E, no, F. What? Anyway. So I guess we're taking the elevator. I'm gonna press all the buttons in here. What the fuck is this? Whoa. Alright. Why? What's going on? What are those glowing red things? I can't even move. It doesn't let me move. What happened? That was weird. Anyway, let's get the drink I've been thirsting for. I have no idea what was going on. It didn't let me move. It took away my ability to do anything. Flashlight? I can't take it, though. Alright. I guess it's just pointing at the thing that I need to interact with. Hmm, the taste of sweet cola. Slurp that shit up quick. The power went out. I'll try to turn it back on, but first I need a light source. Isn't this a hotel? Hardly seems like your responsibility, dog. Now that I have a light source, I need to find a way to turn the power back on. Let me get in behind here. Is this going to have cheap jump scares? I'm feeling like there's going to be jump scares. And they're going to be like $2. That's how cheap. Warning, electricity. Alright, cool. Yay, power's back on. I want to go back to my room. That was a convenient setup. Just right around the corner for you know any person that's staying at the hotel to just pull that breaker whenever they need to. It's a good feature. I like that. I'm going to book my, book a room here next time I go somewhere. Okay, every time I get in the elevator, it makes me look at the floor. Like, you saw how it zoomed me into the floor, right? There's nothing going on there. It's not let you know, it's not letting me see what's actually going on here. And then you glitch a little bit, and then you're, there you go. You got it. Then you're back. It's all about the glitches. It's all about the glitches and, and the fuck-ups. 
That's what makes the world go round. Gotta get them steps in, boy. 101 or 100, I don't know. Let's get back in there with the flickery light. Every time I come to the hotel, I get the one with the flicking light. I, uh, I choose it on purpose. It's a great feature as well. All right, let's play the game. Don't open. Email. I see you're interested. I have no idea who you are. Um, what would the password be? Password? Oh, 9629. Duh. 9629. I understand. You shouldn't have done that. What have I done? Something you shouldn't have. That's all I know. Oh shit. What have I done? Didn't, did you... Oh fuck! No, 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 no. Oh, come on with that. That's an unusual playing style, but still. I'll try again. I'm already back in my room. We'll try one more time. I don't think there's much you can do here. 9629 again. Alright, 9629. Shouldn't have done that. What have I done? And then you get the cool music. And then you, you lag for a little bit. And we're not gonna look behind us this time, Timbo. It's gonna go straight for the elevator, because if we turn around, we're fucked. I mean, we're already kind of fucked. Like, we're walking... Like, no! Don't chase me! There's people crawling past him. No, don't chase me! No, no, no! No, no, no! No, no, no! Okay, good. It glitched my vision again. Is he in here with me? Did you see that? I got it when he was way too close. Is he in here with me? You would, you see him phasing through the doors, right? What kind of glitchy shit are we gonna see next? And then what, just out the door? Like, you know he's here. Oh, he's right fucking behind me, dude. Ah. I got away. He was right on my ass, dude. Like, it looked like his shadow was straight up fucking me, dog. Fucking me hard. Like, he was just out there bouncing around. Shit. Holy. But alright, that wasn't too bad. But alright guys, that was three random games. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. Love talking to you guys. I, I love each and every one of you. Mwah. 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 I hope everybody has a wonderful night. And, of course, as always. Peace out.